Once upon a time, there was a boy. A dog. Who met a very pretty girl. They fell in love and started a lot. In hopes to make the world a better place. This is our story. Good morning, everybody. Uh, just got to the airport in Minneapolis. It's 5.30 in the morning. Good thing I brought my lightweight jacket because it's like 33 degrees outside. I'm dying. <laughs> Waiting for apparently a hotel shuttle that's gonna come scoop me up and take me to the hotel that I probably won't be able to check into. And I'm all alone. The van doesn't land for another like five hours. Just me and my hot tea. So, it is a good morning. Look on the upside. Oh boy, welcome to sunny Los Angeles. Well, that's not right. <laughs> Minneapolis, cold and rainy. The best thing about being able to travel is that there's Chipotle seemingly everywhere you go. And I love Chipotle. <laughs> Allegedly. Door to leave. There you go, nerd, welcome. Sure. Welcome to my uh, favorite franchise. Another really good thing about Chipotle is they have awesome signs. <laughs> you, you guys are inspiring happiness, I love it. We had a little time before sound check, so I'm going into the Mall of America, I believe, and my uh, statistics might be completely wrong, but I believe that it's the biggest mall in America, and that's why they call it the Mall of America. But who really knows, I'm going shopping for Jenny's birthday presents, which uh, I've gotten her a couple different things that I think she might like, but I haven't really gotten the thing that I really want to get her. So I'm going to see if I can find it at the mall without filming it, because she might see this. <laughs> this has got to be the coolest thing I've ever seen. Lego World. Transformers, helicopters, Lego cowboys, Lego discovery people. There's like a minotaur and all, oh my gosh, this mall is amazing. People that live in Minneapolis, you guys are spoiled. There are no other malls. There's a roller coaster in the mall. Look at this dragon. There's freaking out right now. This is so cool. This is so cool. Lego dragon. <laughs> People are looking at me like I'm a little kid, and I am a little kid. This is amazing. Look at this roller coaster. That's the center of the mall. Most centers of the mall just include like some sort of like trampoline thing, like we did in the last vlog or like a Starbucks. That's like the big hit. This is amazing. There's more games. Ah! Holy crap. I love it, I love it. This is also great. Right across from each other are the Microsoft store and sure enough, the Apple store. Right there. <laughs> Which one do you want? So if my math is correct, I ended up going into one one four hundredths of them all. There's 400 times more stuff than what I was able to see, which is crazy. That's the biggest mall ever, but I did find the ever, man, ever in the world. Biggest, biggest mall ever in the world. Uh, but I did find the stuff for Jenny, so that's cool. All this for that one little plastic piece of paper. Love that. Good luck. Uh, thank you, sir. We uh, got meal tickets for the show tonight, so uh, I have a little green ticket that says that I get five dollars in coupons, five dollars in food coupons. Are you going now? Yeah. Okay. All right. You saw what Charles got. I think I upped him a little bit. Apple, toothbrush, Mr. Good Bar. Wait. The crust of a pizza. <laughs> and a soda. Do you win if you get a toothbrush, or do you lose because you forgot your toothbrush? No, because I had like eight dollars to spend, and they were like, you can't you don't get change back from the ticket, the meal ticket, so you can spend up to eight bucks. So I just started grabbing miscellaneous stuff. And that's what it left me with. So I have an apple for when I'm done, like a dessert, or Mr. Goodbar for the dessert, okay? Apple for tomorrow morning, and a toothbrush to get the pizza stuff out of my mouth. Now it wins. I feel like the pizza counters both the turkey wraps that I got. No, it doesn't. I think healthy-wise. In no world. <laughs> As I'm looking here, like, oh, really? <laughs> and I have turkey on my arm. <laughs> you just had a giant turkey tattooed on your arm. I would get a giant turkey. Remember when we always got pigeons on our arm? Wait, I did get a pigeon on my arm. That's for real. You're all gonna get matching pigeons? There's my turkey. It's 
missing its gobbler. Is this is this all free for grabs as well? Yep. It's all Look free. what I got for my eight bucks, Charles. All that. <laughs> now I really win. Since I couldn't juice today because I wasn't in LA, I'm doing all the things that juicing. Oh, you have you have to eat the fruit. <laughs> oh. Yeah, no, I have to eat the fruit you. like you normal people. Juice it with your mouth. <laughs> Oh, I did find a, I have to show you what it is. It's like, do you like- Honestly, not bad. Do you like wheatgrass? <laughs> no, I don't. I could go out and eat normal grass. <laughs> Travis, it's not the same. No, wheatgrass sucks. Really? It's so good for you, but it sucks. You don't feel good after it? Every time I do it, I just feel so invigorated. I can think of at least 20 things that I do that I feel better after than going to the wheatgrass. For example, when I'm home alone in my bed, <laughs> I'm gonna do a couple different things. You guys tell me if it's gross or disgusting. <laughs> gross or, <laughs> or really good. <laughs> you knew it was disgusting. Really good. If it's gross or just extremely disgusting. Um, carrot and apple. Delicious. Dude, they have smoothies like that. It's juice. This cookie. It's and disgusting. bread. Oh, no. It's already gross. <laughs> um, how about... I don't want to. I don't want to believe that. I don't want to believe that. What? I don't want to believe that these are gross. Yeah, try it with something though. Try. Ooh, try it with mayonnaise. Cookie with mayonnaise, gross or really good? You're crazy. These are delicious. Yeah, you're crazy. They're you're crazy, dog. You're are crazy. they ripping good? <laughs> ripping okay. good. Okay. Um, cheese and radish. Probably delicious. The fuck is that song? It's a big radish. It really is. And I still have the carrot and apple in my mouth. Pineapple, pineapple, cheese, and radish? Yeah. Pineapple, cheese, and radish. I feel like the radish is just overpowering everything. Twilight Zone. Mm. Nope. Not good. Not good. Turns out that was not good. Do you guys remember when I wore this? Uh, Gross. Yeah. The school really went above and beyond to get us our green room today. <laughs> we got a shower. <laughs> yep. Which I guess is where we pee and poop as well. Well, so, there's that. Actually, the mirror makes it look way bigger. But it's from hey, here to here. <laughs> That's all we get. Hey, Bill. Hey. Let's go. Let's get the interview. Come on. No, I had my you first five-hour energy drink. You got it. <laughs> It's crazy! Uh, crazy! Woohoo! Come on! Let's go, Bill! Interview time! I'm gonna rip that shirt right off. <laughs> yeah, it's Banana Republic. <laughs> oh no, J. Crew. <laughs> Not my Banana Republic t shirt. Just to switch up the angle. So <laughs> really? <laughs> really? <laughs> too many cameras. I'm gonna throw up. Hunter's got a vlog too. Hunter, where's your yeah, vlogging camera? Here, Hunter. Five hour energy drink is in full force. I don't know why they make this stuff legal. Uh -huh. My brain's working so fast and so slow at the same time. Best brother. Good company name. Best brother. 12, 20. 12. 12,000, 12, 12, 12. Sure. Thank you. Attention. The building fire alarm has been activated. Everybody panic! It's real! I'm using this opportunity while the fire alarm is going off to go to the gym, get some workout done. Yes. What, are you trying to, what are you trying to do? <laughs> <laughs> fucking good kid. What? I'm a fucking kid. Uh, you do that to me all the time. Live so Billy that. now has to film for Charles, Danny, and myself. I'm just waiting for Hunter to bring out his vlog. Yeah. Unless he's cooking something on stage. It's just a matter of time before <laughs> he's doing pancakes, the Pancakes, people! Pancakes! Pancakes oh, and yeah. music! Come in and get them! Hot and fresh! You just, want beef. you just want like random shit? Yeah, film the dumb shit for, for Charles and mm -hmm. Danny. Uh, anytime you see something cool, we just grab this one, it's the black one. Okay, so cool. So not that one, but this one. Okay. Danny's is probably cracked and lost. <laughs> Showtime!
Well, that show was awesome and sweaty, and I lost my voice because I was screaming too loud. But Billy killed it. Yeah, good job. It's, it's been his first time in a long time, but the show was incredible. He killed it. I hope you guys liked the clip that you saw. If he did film anything, that is. I see it. It made me sick. Make me gay. You can look at it in the car. Whoa! Oh. <laughs> it's about to come out. Oh man! Are you gonna puke? Oh yeah. <laughs> I remember when I was losing She's teeth. My ma parents would tie a uh, string to it and slam it to a door or slam it to the dog and the dog would oh. rip it off or the door would. I would always do the door. Or a baseball bat. I never did baseball would, bat. Yeah, your parents didn't hit you with a baseball bat right in your face? My no, parents loved me. Took up fires and just take it in, which... I would be scarred for life. Yeah. That was mean. <laughs> this is crazy. <laughs> That literally sounds like you're possessed. Oh, God. oh my God! Does that hurt? No, sometimes it tastes blood. Sometimes I don't. How do you do that? Yeah, maybe you should not do that anymore. And then it comes out. Are you doing it? Wait, was that you? It's terrifying. I'm gonna puke. She's What's happening? Who's dying? Who needs medical attention? It's coming out. <laughs> you can do it. Oh. <laughs> Ew. It's already out. You just gotta pull it. You just gotta pull it. Pull it. It's hanging out. Do you want me to pull it out? Mm -mm. Yeah. No? Here, wiggle it. You don't want me turn to pull out your circle. teeth? That's weird. Yeah, turn it into a circle. I want to wait until we get to the hotel. Okay, that's okay. fine. Okay. Right. I don't want to lose it. Nobody's forcing you here except the other Please. six people I'm in this room. <laughs> <laughs> we just got back to the hotel. What an amazing show and day. I can't breathe. <laughs> Ah, uh, I need to sleep so badly. <laughs> I couldn't have caught that at a more perfect time. Did you get it? I, I got the whole thing. Uh, that's amazing. Uh, we love you guys, and by we, I mean Bill and I. We love you guys and hope that you have a phenomenal today, tomorrow, and forever. Peace! Remember how I was talking about uh, every Jeep has, kind of has like a, it's almost like a guy code or a girl code or any of like these codes. There's a Jeep code where all Jeeps will wave to each other. So uh, there's a Jeep right across the street and you can see it and it's going to come right at us and I'm going to wave at him and see if he waves back or she. Apparently he doesn't know the Jeep code. Yeah, big fail. That was a fail. You get this like insane sunset. I don't know if you guys can see it. Look, it's so blue and so gold. That's crazy. And then it gets like red there. And like purples. 